Pitlick. A nice move there by Seaman Pitlick. Uh, bounces right past the defender. Classic move from Czech centre block. And the gaps appearing elsewhere. Uh, Seaman Pitlick proves yet again. Stays on the left hand side. Say that I look down. Emil Nielsen gets up off his chair, begins to stretch. Nielsen. And away comes Seaman Putlick over the halfway line. Goes alone. That was real. Elf Emil. I know it might have felt like that a couple of days ago. And stuff. Greece off to a flyer at the start of this second half. Elder statesman of them, which uh, says something. Great ball into Jorgensen. He gets himself free. Place the pass the keeper with a plum. Lucas Jorgensen. This is profile big time in this second half. And like a bit of a high hit there, but that didn't bother Seaman Putlick. Rode the challenge. Very little angle for that shot, but he found the space. Great to see. And the 29-year-old playing in AK Athens. He's uh, making a name for himself in this different type of game. So the context is always so important in these situations. Over to Putlick. Miguel Hansen, Putlick in the centre. Full speed, Paul out to the wing to Landine, and then Gietzel plays it off down the left hand side. Ball out to Landine again. Could he get two in a row? Yes, eventually he does. Ball out to the left hand side. Well, that was really well worked, and I think that was done on purpose. It wasn't just Mulgard trying to be great. Landine with three saves already in this contest. Gietzel in the left hand side. Excellent play. So incisive, and the combo between Gietzel and Pitlick couldn't get there, and the 18 year old. It's his man, uh, they're an immediate response down the other end. Oh, this Danish team are really not mess. Hansen, Pitlick, cuts across. Gietzel's on the wrong side for him, but it doesn't matter because Steven Pitlick pops that one across the face of goal. Going to be uh, the first major championship for both of them. Lays it off. Gietzel, Pitlick, clean through. Uh, Pitlick scores the first of the second half. Three goal lead. Took a step or two too many along the way. Speaking of which, Giesel lays it off to Putlick. Ah, oh, classic Seema Putlick finish. The flying sock. See uh, a change uh, with Kirkeluka and the Portuguese, but here they're really setting the game alight. Uh, Seema Putlick getting back in on the act. Seven for him. The big celebration because they were never going to beat Denmark. Here, it feels like they're a little bit more at the park. Game ball out to Gietzel, overlap down the left-hand side. Seaman Pitlick in acres of space. A nice set of play. And topic, and uh, he said there were so many options for him, so many opportunities for him against Sweden. Although he might have picked up nine assists, he probably... A new line player in the team. Overlap down the left-hand side. Ah, oh, Jakobsen did well. All champions. What a time for him to step up for this team. Uh, on the right-hand side. And what Denmark did so well against Portugal was kept on dishing the ball until they found a solution. Good start for him. He opens Netherlands' account in this second half. And the breakthrough down the penalty duty only to throw the ball around a little bit. Here he is. Here's it off to Pitlick in the man-up situation. Lauga. Nice ball out to Pitlick. Yeah, Pitlick makes no mistake this time. A four-goal lead for Denmark. Giving the ball away. Travelling violation or attacker foul. Take your pick there in that situation. Also know how to deal with it. And they'll know their moves inside out. Uh, that's a penalty. Gietzel. Gives it down the left-hand side. Nice ball out to Emil Jakobsen. Putlik. Ball into the line. Southstrup all alone. Places it past the standing leg. Denmark in the lead again. Gietzel. Look, looking for the line, and Saugstrup gets it again this time. No goal, but a penalty. With the starting lineup still, and they're holding on to them for as long as possible. They are pretty fresh, though. You have to see. And high scoring here so far 25 goals between the sides. So far, Lindbergh goes out to the right wing. All over the top to Pitlick. Uh, this time he makes no mistake. Back on the scoreboard, Seaman Pitlick. Gietzel. Pitlick. Hesitated for a moment, but well, not for long. He finds a way past the keeper. Just his left here on this suspension. Pitlick cuts inside. Oh, well saved, but a penalty. Palika gets a stop, but two for two for him. Pitlick on the left-hand side. Hesitated for a moment, but then he was left all alone. But a good finish by Simon Liza, his first of the day.
Ball into the line, a good save, but it's going to be a penalty and a two-minute suspension to go with it against Harold Rankin. You know what to do. Ball into the line. Southstrap. Into the bottom left-hand corner. Denmark continue to score with ease. A two-goal lead restored. The fifth goal of the game. Second in a while. Pitlick all alone. And you cannot give Simo Pitlick any space, never mind half of the court. Geetzel. Pitlick. Tight angle, but Geetzel, the movement here, just relentless for Denmark. And the shot from Sima Pitlick. Sidearm fury right through the. Then sit down the left hand side. Sogstrap, nice movement off the ball. He receives it, and he'll get the penalty if he doesn't get. Mensa. Pitlick, oh, he sends a defense down the road to get a pint of milk as he fires in his fifth catch. Do so on the home of handball app. And a penalty down the left hand side, inside defending. Called against Norway. Kent Robinson. A second half performance, but Brave won't do it at this level against a team like this. Penalty for Pitlick. And when they need to, they just come up with. So. Bruno Damka, who was injured before the start. And off. Not had time to change him. And uh, Pitlick beautifully sidestepped through the German defence. Or is that uh, Germany might uh, sell on this game at all? Long range shot. Hüttling, he finds a way through. Taken by Kirkeluk, looks for the line. Southstrup, penalty. Kolbach kept on the bench because of his uh, double suspensions. The new lineup is uh, holding reasonably well. Who's Tunes and Gola? But the click into the wing. That's good. Nice. The click into the wing. Oh, brilliant goal. Spun it underneath him. Emil Jakobsen is fourth. Uh, well, Jakobsen was playing. He's one of the few who was finding a little bit of chance. Seven against six now. Ah, and that's uh, uh, one more little slip from him, and it's a red card. Oh, lovely shot. Putlik, absolute pattern foul by Putlik. Oh, stops well and goes through, defending inside the area. Penalty. Kolbacher caught by the pace of the attack. Slip by Putlik, play on. And now Hansen in acres of space puts it. We have a power play now. Change on the right wing. Ah, oh, brilliant. Quickly, you can really take the pressure. Missables. Quickly into the line. And no. They had the lead, then France took a 6 4 lead. And now four goals without reply. Make that uh, five. South Club again. Back to back goals for the uh, Danish. And no chance. Out. Quickly. Ah, oh, brilliant. Draws the defenders. He's a big, powerful player, and there's a lot more lateral play. And that's looking half back to back for Denmark now. Two from France to come back into the game. Again, slow defending. And that was the uh, defense specialist, Conor Gal Hansen. Switches back again. Oh, look for the opening. The inter coming up. Ten minutes remaining in the final. Brilliant! What a goal! Simon Pitlick. Instead of Harold Pitlick. Oh, bullet! And Bilassen didn't even see that one coming. Break through. Off the post. Penalty. Denmark. Just under one.